Good kitten internet. Meow. So this is actually the second episode that we recorded today, but unfortunately, this TV happened. And Windows. And Windows. Take your pick as to the actual... Cul the TV is the culprit, but Windows definitely hurt things. Long story short, we recorded the previous video, but I've actually been playing at 1440p instead of 4K in order to smooth out the frame rate. Not to mention, I can't tell the difference whatsoever when I'm playing anyway. But Windows decided to go change the resolution on us, along with the frame rate. At the start of this, I noticed the frame rate, I didn't notice the resolution. So we only recorded half of the screen. So, what we're going to do is, I'm going to summarize what happened in the plant research facility, and then we're going to load the game afterward. There is no important plot. But long story short, we went inside the plant facility, and surprise, surprise... Plants, have, plants grown have grown all over the place. Yes. And then Ecliptic showed up. Yep. Ecliptic showed up with no explanation given. Started fighting the creatures and lost outside, strangely <laughs> enough. They lost against peaceful creatures. Yes. Yeah, losers. Yep. But there is a magazine up here that we're actually going to go grab. Assuming I can fly up high enough. Also, we are having audio issues. I don't think you are, but I'm not sure. Damn it. Come on. So basically, I'm just working my way around the entire place to go up to where the magazine was to show you. Don't worry, friend. This was actually in daytime when we were here. But the magazine is right here, and I actually found it myself. Other than asking at a previous location, uh, did I miss it? Otherwise, yeah, plants went wild. Um, there's a crap ton of plant growth inside of this facility. Yep, and They're a lot, growing of, a lot of dead scientists. And a lot of dead scientists, including inside of trees. So there we go. We summarized that. Um, we also had an encounter in space, but it's a random encounter. No, it's a one-time encounter. But, oh, it's a one-time encounter? But it happens randomly. Ah, okay. So, to explain the encounter, basically we encountered a ship, and a captain was firing off a distress signal, got interrupted by the obvious spacers that took over the ship. Um, we attempted to board the ship. We succeeded at boarding, but however, Bethesda glitches the encounter, where all of your companions think that you're boarding and pirating an innocent ship. Then we reloaded, and did the encounter again, but I fired on them before they fired on me, thus all my encounters thought that I was firing on an innocent ship. And yeah, that's about it. Otherwise, we offloaded things. I think it was because you fired before it turned from um, yes. white to red. Which it wasn't able to turn to red until it got weapons online. Mm -hmm. Anyway, we unloaded thing, and between videos I had actually unloaded things, and going back to the lodge, and that is it. That's all that happened in the video that's not being uploaded because there's no reason to. So I have components down there. I have stuff I need to go sell over there because I've ran out of people willing to buy things. And I have food there. Alright. So, main plot. Yep. Because Andresia's affinity goes up so slowly. Yes. I return um, to the lodge. Triggered a full system update. I am now fully prepared to assist you. What? Anyway, um, yeah, we were trying to get Andresia's affinity up high enough to be able to trigger her plot. It didn't happen. Uh, mostly because her affinity is crawling ahead. Welcome back, Captain. Look at how far we've come. It's all becoming so overwhelming. The Starborn, the artifact visions, the music. Is it all worth it? Mateo, are you... Having a crisis of faith? You? What if the Starborn are right? What if our hunt for the artifacts is a fool's errand, doomed to failure and catastrophe? You think we're doing the wrong thing? We just want answers. 
Isn't that why we all joined in the first place? The noble quest of discovery? I forgot to use my power first, mm -hmm. but, you know. Um, if you pick the top option, most people will dislike that. Yeah, that's a fairly obvious thing. I mean, we can't abandon who we are. Agreed. We should not abandon our mission. Now she triggers it. I'm sorry. I'm not trying to shame either of you. Blame the workings of a worried mind. I just hope that this journey doesn't turn us into something that we wouldn't recognize from where we are now. Hate to interrupt, but I have a favor to ask. Lot of equipment on the eye has reached the span's end. If we're going to find more artifacts further out, we need work done. Got the nods and signs from Sarah and Walter for the materials, but I need hands. Doesn't that bother your wife? Ah, yes, well. My wife and I have something of an understanding. Apparently, I become rather cranky when I'm not able to participate in Constellation's little adventures. It has been determined that for the long-term health of our relationship, that I am better off here, rather than simply making things worse at home. Console parts, replacement wires that have burned out, some fixes to the intercom between the station and the lot. Okay, I can help with that. Won't be going alone. Need more than just the you and I. Ask around. A few constellations are already on their way up. All right. If you are free soon. Yes. Could we talk? I'll be heading to the eye to assist nope. momentarily. Yeah. It's good to be checking in on Vladimir. We don't visit often you enough. You literally just told me. <sighs> Bethesda. Stop scripting this crap. This isn't just a Bethesda problem. This is a problem with a lot of games where they will have overriding scripting that prevents other things from happening, even when it doesn't make logical sense to do so. Yeah, like when when <laughs> on one of my characters, well, I, I had to make the Terramorph attack on New Atlantis at happen because otherwise I couldn't progress Sarah's quest because that had a part where I was going to talk to um, the Admiral but he was in the meeting mm -hmm. with the other about the Terramorphs and... Yeah. It is possible to do these things without sequencing them stupidly. It's not that hard. You just have to think about it and you have to design things where it makes sense. Why is it pointing me at the commercial district and not the Razor Leaf? I don't know. Just goes with Razor Leaf. Take off. Why Sparrow on the ground? Mm -mm. Well, he is assigned to the Razor Leaf. Oh yeah, something else. Um, I dropped the musical volume down quite a bit. I. I. Oh, cool. My frame rates dropped to 60 frames per second again. Forget it. in on everyone. Okay, I could do that. So Setting we've got Barrett software. over here. Want to test the computer over there? Help Vladimir code up this system the first time. Now, how did this work again? 
It's a different operating system. Or a different theme. Yeah. Now that yeah, it's the same operating system. Teamwork. All I did was hit ping. Lend a hand. All right, Sarah. Grab a couple of wrenches and let's tighten this equipment down. Wrenches. What? That's done it. Go on. See who else needs some help. This feels more like a mod. Like, there's a lot of Skyrim and Oblivion mods that work very similarly. Mm -hmm. Like give it, giving you a dialogue box. Yes. Explaining what happens instead of Show giving it. you an animation. Hey, you mind helping me weld up some of these panels? Ah, uh, miss coming up here. We should visit Vlad more often. Dad! And Cora. Oh. Pay attention! <sighs> Well, can't win them all, I guess. Yeah, and it's uh, not showing anything. I didn't do it. Don't look at me. I didn't well, touch anything. Well, supposed to happen. So, where's Andresha? Uh, in the uh, cafeteria. Cafeteria. Ah. This, if you could help me install these parts. Box of parts. You assemble the parts. I think we are done. Thank you. Thank you again. Nobody's in on the toilet. Or that toilet. Or the 50 bajillion other toilets. Anybody in the storage room? Doesn't look that way. I already talked to Cora. Uh, I didn't do it. Nobody's working out. I think Mateo, Noel, and and uh, Walter pretty much just stay at the lodge all the time, except during except, uh, yeah. all that money can buy. Walter was with us, but mm -hmm. it was like there's. No quest that's focused on Noel. There's one quest where Matteo has a part, but it's not really about him. I had to flip the toilet paper. I didn't realize you could do that here. I thought it was just on Victera and Casal. I found this one on my other character. Mm. Uh, is that everybody? Yeah. I have things from here. Good work. Perfect. Uh, I got a few more dark corners of my software to check. Oh boy, better talk to Vladimir. You call her the wrong wires. Station showing red. Uh, there was... Oh, actually, I can... Jaw the words another time. Jaw the words? You call her the wrong wires. A bad set. Bad. <laughs> <laughs> I was expecting more than this. But there was some kind of problem with the repair sample. Nastier than I measured. Figured a few of the parts might be iffy, but this is going to take more than a span. I won't leave you hanging, Vladimir. Cora and I can stay with you until the eye is back to 100%. No need for the martyr's clothes, but I'm happy to have the help. As for you, while we're giving the eye the swords, need to tip your ear on another matter when you got the time. I gained you some parts. Sight to behold. Hey, if you go, I'll follow. Come back soon. Of course I can. Today's a peach of a day. As long as I can tell you something bad. Just don't ever go, love. All good things must come. How are you feeling? Uh, how are you feeling about our marriage? <laughs> well, 
Yep, I just wanted to see if I could trick the yes, game into. You need nope. Me? All right. Yep. Now the uh, crew is on a. They're on a. Forgot to check the math on a few equations. For a while. The brain's long gone. I forgot to. Forgetfulness. That's my spell again. Don't want to worry anyone, but we got more competition. Not Starborn, rival collector. Captain Petrov owns a salvager vessel called ah, the yes. Scow. Runs it like a palace of novelties. And he's got a new prize in his collection. Raise the thoughts with you later. Don't want to worry anyone. Captain Petrov. The scavenger, apparently. Oh, we had a sentry collecting unlock. Reached out through my hand to hands to see if we can do an honest swap. He says the rock ain't for sale for any price. Think we're gonna need the crowbar and bag for this one. <laughs> Think Petrov knows more about the artifacts? He's got a reputation for seeing the gold in things, but he's no lab coat. Thinking he knows it's unique, but not why. All the more reason to clutch tightly. So, you're saying we need to steal it from him? Left the life of a jack of wounds behind myself. I know what I'm asking. But I see a clutch prize not up for the prying any other way. Not sending you lone hook on the job. I want Sarah with you on this one. Sarah? You two will be foot to foot the whole way. So, make sure you're ready. Well, I mean, sure. Yeah. Unfortunately, I didn't take weapons from Kendrasia or Sam. Eh. Uh, really think we have to steal it? As we always say, each member of Constellation is their own conscience. I'll leave the details of the doing to you. All right. Catch a smile out there. Okay, Sarah. Wherever you went, there you are. Yeah, what is it? If you have any gear... So, what type of weaponry does Sarah use? Her regular weapon is a solstice, so 1.5 kilovolts. Okay. Um, I don't have... Give special her, weapons at the moment. Give her a few med packs. Or other packs. Okay. Maybe another time. So I will keep my eye out for a weapon for Sarah. Yeah, she has skill in lasers. But I don't think there are any good laser weapons in there. Oh, there's she just something for me. the solstice, the equinox, and the Orion. Mm -hmm. And they're upgraded versions. Yeah, zone back off. Zone. Can I help? Yes. Have a look. Oh boy, a root. How about some personal questions? Because now we actually have our talk to her about all of that. Alright, back to the seat. Entering from the right side instead of the left. Undock. I'm not so sure you were going to get Barrett for this one. Uh, apparently not. I have done it with each of them, and I think Barrett is the most fun. But I don't get to have Barrett. No. So, uh, my intent is to continue this plotline until basically I have people back. That makes the most sense to me. Yeah. Especially since I don't have crew members on my ship right now. I know I could go out and hire some, but is it even worth doing? Oh, 
There's the scow. That's not what I want to do. Business with the scow. Our captain is not taking visitors. I have business with Petrov. It's important. No one uninvited boards the scow. Captain's orders. I mean, I've heard stories about your magnificent ship. The captain does love letters. And we're here to trade. Nothing more. No. Captain's orders. It's not for sale. That's why it doesn't make sense to do that. I know. That. You think you scare me? Who are you? Some fast talking. You've got something for me? Oh, it's disabled. Yes, but there are other ships. Ah, yeah. Or there are turrets. Turrets. Yeah. Your hole. Yeah. I have never failed at talking my way on board. Even with parrots. So what I was trying to do was get up. I can't get up while the ship's there. Oh. Nope. Yeah. This is one thing I hate about. What do you want to get up for? I was going to cast my ability. You. Uh, you don't have business but, with this. Oh well. Don't force my hand. Now, we're not looking for trouble. All right. I'll clear you to dock. Keep yourself out of trouble, or we'll have every hired gun in the cargo bay after you. Hey. Hey. The scow is pretty big. Yeah, and it has multiple docking ports, mm -hmm. which, which you're not allowed to have. Nope. But class M ships are. Yep. Board, and I'll talk to Sarah at the entrance because it sounds like she has something to say. No, I don't think so. Yes. Nope. Until later. Okay. Uh, where am I supposed to go? Oh. Why? When every other ship works in a different way. Wash your damn hands. Well, obvious sign of Bethesda actually designed the ship differently than the rest. You will be. We'll let you on board. Yeah, stuck in Petrov conversation. Petrov was done hiring mosquitoes. Or maybe. Fine. Just ignore me then. We'll let you on board. Mosquito? Well, he calls us some old Earth term. Oh, God, the captain's gonna love you. <laughs> Just what I need. Two blowhards. I trust I'm invited to the party as well. Go on, then. This is more fun with Barrett because he goes, Excuse me, three blowhards. <laughs> Trade it for. 
some dusty hauling ore from the fringe. <laughs> Was glad when he left. It's all shakes and muttering. Well, we know who touched it then. Mm -hmm. Strewn about all over. The good stuff's locked up in a vault for Petrov's own personal viewing pleasure. And before you ask, Petrov's the only one with the keys, so don't try bribing any of the crew. You just waste your money. Why would you tell me that? You would just accept the bribes. That would be mm -hmm. way better. Petrov's got a whole little alien zoo in the back. He's asking for trouble with those things. Well, I'm seeing one way of doing this. High end, thankfully. Uh, yep. Wow, this place is a dump. Like a garbage scout. Yeah, bag. but if you do this um, before completing the UC plotline, then those are heat leeches instead of xenograbs. Ah. Interesting. Yeah, it seems to me like they just after... To swap them. Yeah, just... That's kind of dumb. Replace them with I mean, it's a quick way of doing it, but it's still kind of dumb. Uh, Interesting. There are a couple of places, I think, where the guards turn hostile if you go in, so quick save every once in a while. Yep. Oh dear. The penultimate panopticon of prosperity! <laughs> Rocks. And coral. And yeah. And a fishbowl. More guards? More guards. So I'm assuming. That if I had Andresia with me instead, Andresia would want me to go guns a blazing. Uh, I'm not sure. Hmm. Ooh, oh, what a collection! I know, and I can't take them. Um, maybe you should give Sarah a, a Nova Blast Disruptor. I'm assuming you would prefer to go through this without killing anyone? Yeah. I'm listening. I'd be happy to get... Don't you have one in your ship's cargo hold? No. I've gotten rid of... Yeah, I... Okay. Yes, I just got rid of them. Mm. I only have the one that I have. Have something for me? Oh. Yeah. Bye. Presumably, it's follow the hose. You have a face. Got work to do. You're a crew rather than a guard. Got it. That's a shotgun. Okay. No, oh, that's a lawgiver, isn't it? That yeah, lawgivers that... are shotguns in my mind. No, they're not. They're rifles. They don't look like it. And their range is kind of garbage. Yeah, but they're not shotguns. I suppose. The mask. I think that that's a unique item. Hmm. My other character would love this place. Lots mm -hmm. of things to steal. Yep. This character is not the stealing type. Moby Dick? 
Story of Heavens? Story of the Heavens is a rare book, isn't it? It's expensive. But it's not one of the books that... Oh, there he is. precognition. I'm going to. I'm not sure a power like that was meant for humankind. To... Howdy. Well, gentlemen, we have a newcomer. Place your bets. I'll go with buying. A hundred credits says they leave with one of the captain's glorious golden statues. You know those are colored aluminum, right? <laughs> I say selling, but nothing the captain wants. You win, Bull? Yeah, yeah. Count me in. I say selling. A cargo hold of old oil paintings. All fakes. Mmm, bold. I like it. Us? We're in, uh, acquisitions. Mm -hmm. She means we hunt things down and steal them. Yeah. Uh, From bad people. Mostly. Mostly. A lot of these old relics the captain collects don't have legitimate owners. Uh, so it's sort of right by possession, you know? And uh, we help with the possession part. Mm-hmm. No, I'm actually here with the United Colony Sanitation. This whole ship is a health hazard. Well, there isn't any such thing. If only. All the stuff the captain's collected, and he never found something that would clean up around here. I think it's by choice. Kind of a trash king chic, you know? Certainly not good for security, though. Quiet! No spilling the captain's <laughs> secrets. <laughs> not for free, anyway. You know, I can use a little bit of info. Yeah, that, that's an utter lie, and I know it. <laughs> oh, we would never do that. We love our captain. We love his money. <laughs> oh, yeah. Right. <laughs> Hand over the credits, then. Let's talk. I hear the back end of the vault butts up against the old conveyor belt system. Crucesus' walls were just meant as partitions. They're thin, held up by a few old security bolts. A okay. lamp could just cut right through them. Not that you would, being a respectful guest oh, of the ship and all. Not. So you all work together? Oh no. God no. Each of us works solo. <laughs> We'd kill each other if we had to team up. I actually think it wouldn't be so bad. We hang out all the time. Exactly. I got precious little separation between my life <laughs> and you two as it is. So, what's about the captain? I mean, look around, you know? This ship kinda says it all. He's a self-obsessed megalomaniac with delusions of grandeur. I don't think that's fair. He's just eccentric, like a best friend who's great in really, really small doses. <laughs> One thing he's good for is steady pay. He knows how to spread the wealth around. So, got anything else? Uh... You hear about the zoo? Captain went through a phase, and now there's a whole mess of alien wildlife in cages below deck. They don't look happy there at all. Not They're in cages. Why would they be happy? And how can you tell? They're aliens. I don't know. They just seem sad. <laughs> I like Raptor. <laughs> anyway, the technician for the cages quit recently. And I have it on good authority that the password is now Idiot oh, Idiot Captain. captain. <laughs> Worth a chuckle if you want to try it. But don't, because those aliens might kill everyone. I would say don't go with that option. Yeah, because I'm Hello. trying to do this without... Do I even need to talk to the captain at all? I don't think so, but... Because my instinct is to immediately... Find, uh... Yes. Yeah. I haven't tried not talking to the cat. So, let's try it. Alright. Now, how do I get to any of these places? Maybe make a hard save here. Real save. Just in case. Here. Because it's kind of a waste to not talk to him. He's such a character. You know, people say he's mad, but I like Petra. Runs a good ship. I think you'll be launched into conversation with him if you step close enough. Yeah. So. You hear there's alien creatures on board the ship? Captain calls it a zoo. 
Well, there's no way for me to do it until I go through. So, if I get launched in conversation, you know, if it were nope. up to me, we would. Zoo? I think I would prefer going the other route, though. You meet Vadak yet? The captain's right hand. Yeah, I'm thinking you're not, you're it. not Hope you're here. ready to <laughs> die. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so how am I going to get through them without them noticing? This is not a great stealth character. Yeah, and also you're Talk forced to, to have a companion with you. He's glorious, yeah. this will guide you. <sighs> Enjoy your time on board this cow. His personal area. He has a plushy cobble store. And the Zenith Snuggle. The Zenith Snuggle. My first credit. Really? He's a thief. Bathroom? No. All. I don't need to talk to the captain Ooh. anymore. If you want, after I do this, I can load and talk to the captain. Hey, you meet Vadek yet? The captain's right hand. I've never seen a man so exhausted. Hmm. Maybe your best bet would be to uh, go in with the uh, Noah Blast Disruptor, just drop everyone unconscious. Hmm? I'll be right here. A lot of the guards here are bounty hunters, smugglers, or salvagers from the fringes. Lots of shark smiles, you know? Yeah, the thing is that they're facing me. There is no way for me to sneak through that. Like, none at all. What the heck was that? Fire! No. It triggers everything. That's not going to work. So unless if the animals would distract the guards, I'm not seeing a great way to do that. Releasing the animals most likely will lead to some crew members dying. The yeah. non-guard crew members. I don't like that. That's locked. It's like, the guards at least have signed up for dealing with hostile situations. Mm -hmm. Lock that off. So at least there's fewer guards I need to deal with. That's a no-no zone. Mm, that guard had a disruptor. Mm -hmm. Wouldn't it just open up all of this area? Mm -hmm. So are there even any non-guards in this area? Maybe? I'm not sure. There's a guard. They're not going to open doors. Although they just keep opening them, so that doesn't help me. Mm -hmm. So never mind. So my plan was just close the door. And then I only have these folks to deal with, but that does not work. You meet Vadak yet? Nope, there's the crew here. Right mm -hmm. hand. Never seen a so, man so exhausted. Try talking to the captain. You picked the wrong fight. <laughs> I have the key. Oh no, I don't. That's right. And everybody's aggro. Really? 
Even the crew's aggro. Yep. Well, I guess I'm talking to the captain. This is a tricky quest, especially if you don't want to kill anyone. Well, especially since I'm not playing a stealth Talk character. Ah, I wasn't aware we had the visitors. Wadik, you didn't tell me we had visitors. <sighs> we have visitors. <laughs> Excellent. Now that you've gone to all this trouble to get here, you should make yourself at home. His voice sounds familiar. Relax. Kick up your feet on the tables. I don't care they have scorch marks on them anyway. Ah, uh, one moment. Everyone's Apparently it expired. <sighs> ah, I will never get I used to seeing you do that. <sighs> Excellent. Relax. And obviously... <laughs> That's why I don't need no visitors. Ooh, flattery. My favorite pastime. Oh, ho, ho. flattery, huh? My favorite pastime, huh? Between you and me, I do have something very special in the vault. Ah, but my jealous heart knows no bounds. I want to keep it all to myself. Come on. Steam I do love showing off. But my security team will have a heart attack. It would be against all those protocols that I admittedly told I them to, to make. The voice actor. I mean, what's the good of a vast collection if you can't show it off? Oh ho! You do have a point. I mean, there's no reason for us to have a point. You don't know what oh. you're talking about. I get it. Your collection's too small. Hardly worth seeing. Now, now, no need to be insulting. Hmm. Ah, very well. What's a quick look going to hurt, huh? Indeed. I know. People look at me and say, Petro. You know, your whole ship is a if testament it were up to of me, splendor. We Why do you need a special a vault? We haven't fed it personally. Well, all I can say is that even the greatest collection needs its own private viewing area. Plus, between you and me, there are thieves everywhere. No idea who you might so be talking about. So I spare no expense. Every door between me and my treasures is painful. But that is the price really. of security, huh? I could have absolutely yes, uh, taken out the entire ship. That's not that just hard. Just a bit further. This ship and I have been through some adventures, I'll tell you. I once collected salvage from a demo celestial class while it was exploding. The crew was scraping scorch marks and bits of metal off the hull for weeks. And, of course, there was the time I accidentally steered us into a UC Navy vessel after a particularly uproarious celebration Anybody of yet? my latest the acquisitions right of fine art. Never seen a man so exhausted. We yep. were wedged That's what I thought his voice between them running. two thrusters and were able to just kind of push them back into the star yard for repairs. I kinda wish story time with Vatic or that with Petra was longer because he has some stories. Uh so for reference, he is a very frequent Bethesda voice actor. Okay. Um the voice of Barbarus, Clavicus Vile, and Mercer Frey, for an example. Ah. That's where I was thinking it was. Also the voice of Nick Valentine. Yep. Now, the moment itself. Ooh. Ah, beautiful, isn't it? The man who sold oh. me this told me that it spoke to him. That holding it for the first time was like drowning in your own soul. Alas, I've held it several times and my soul is still breathing. That's unfortunate. Devoid of any such enlightenment. 
<laughs> Thank you, Petra. You can die now. Just thought I would see if I can pull that off. It would have been hilarious if I could. It's like, what artifact? What are you talking about? The man who sold him. Oh, Alas, did I, I not? Don't... Okay, I did. Is he pulling out of bedrock? Why, yes, he did. I wish I could learn who it was. I mean, I'll pay for it. Name your price. Oh, no. No, no, no. I can't. This one is mine. And it's only fair to warn you. Hands off! I would hate to sour our new friendship by becoming the victim of piracy. We're not taking anything, unless you make things unreasonable for us. <laughs> it's for science! <laughs> Nothing I can do to change your mind? I'm afraid not. I'm easy in all things, except my collection. Seriously? I don't, I, I guess I just back off from here. Yeah, but now he's here. Yeah. That's the panel, obviously. But the wrong side of it. Yes. Assassin's Calibrated Beowulf. That's the front side of it, I'm guessing? Oh, oh not literal front side, but that's how you would get there. Maybe? I'm not sure. You I'm haven't not, gone there? I'm not familiar with the back roads. Idea. I think I can do this from the quick save. But I don't remember where I I might have overwritten the quick save that I wanted to keep. When you had grabbed a key? Yep. No, um. Mm. That was not what I was referring to. So my theory is that you talk to him and then just run ahead. Mm. I want to see if I can do that. Talk to Petrov. His gloriousness will guide you. Ah, I wasn't. <sighs> Excellent. Relax. Oh, ho, ho. between. I was you. hoping I quick saved after the persuasion check is what it is. Might keep your bullet headed. Because it's mine. I get it. It's small, isn't it? Psychology. Good as if you can't oh, show it up. <laughs> Try it. Nope. No. Enjoy your time on board the scow. Well, that's annoying. Really wish I had that other quick save. Mm. Do you want to know the best way of doing it? Sure. Or at least a way. A way that doesn't kill anyone. Mm -hmm. Do you have a quick save where you're at the artifact for them? Yeah. Then that's where you should be. You um, either grab it, he turns hostile, or you um, tell him that report us for piracy if you must, but the I must man have it. Alas, I... And then immediately shotgun to the face. Well, I think I touched that artifact and I'll make sure every trade route. If you think that threat is going to cause us Apparently to just like walk that. away, yeah, like that. you're huh. more foolish than. Then I suppose it's just a quest. Go ahead. 
You've done an admirable job Off of trying like to keep your cool. But I'm afraid the captain isn't going Because if you defeat him, then uh, he will order his entire crew to surrender. So, in other words... I think you need to grab the artifact first. Ah. And... I'm not sure if it's... It's probably not going to help if you stun him. He is probably essential or something. I'm gonna try it anyway. Oh, filthy pirate! Ah, come on! He is not taking any stun damage. Yeah. Give it your um, best sounds shot. vaguely familiar. Well, that's why I quick saved. But so what is my highest single damage weapon? Do you have a shotgun at all? Yes. Yeah, the coachman would be best for this. Don't even Wait, need a gun. I surrender! I surrender! Don't One kill me! Mm -hmm. I wish I had the Z up. Uh-huh. Well, tell your crew to stand down and no one else gets hurt. But what about the... I didn't want to take the artifact by force. Sure. You left us with little choice. Ah! I see it now. Go then. Leave my ship with your heart's desire. I have not found a way to do this the without United getting a bounty, colonies. by the way. Yeah. But it's only 500 credits. Why is my hand holding the shotgun that's not there? Also, you, you even... I can take things now? Um, yeah. uh, people are aggro with me. They're not supposed to be? Now they're not. Maybe it's the aliens? Possible. Anyway... Right, sheathing your weapon? Anyway, now that... So what? We're just gonna let you loot the ship? Now you're allowed to pick up anything, because they surrendered. So you can get those, my friend Wilbies, yes. if you want. Yes, I do. And you can take their sweet rolls. Hey, hey, I'm not getting in your way. Take everything you want. Contraband cash, I don't care. Taking the vault key anyway, just because. My motorcycle's mine. You can have the black market antiquities. Now, what would be really funny is if each of these items caused me to get a larger bounty. Mm -hmm. As in, he gets more, progressively more pissed off by certain things being taken. Like the plushies. Not like my life chunk by chunk, though. Nobody cares about that. It's over, right? You're going to leave? Yes, I will eventually leave. No longer... Trespassing. Trespassing. Is there anything else in this place that I might want? I mean, there's a lot of decorative ob objects. Other than decorative um, There are a few uh, weapon cases. Say we go a few more rounds. Captain's going to find some way to blame this all on me. I just know it. Can't even interact with him. Yes, I can. Take what you want. What's mine is yours. Filthy pirate. We are not going to forget this. Says the pirate to the pirate. It's just a reactive gauge, really. I don't know. This definitely feels like there is a way of doing it without whoa, whoa, hey, this. Backing off. Um. Captain says you're okay. You're okay. Don't remember specifically where, but I, there are at least a couple of random uh, enchanted weapons. But with your luck, it's probably a. <laughs> Varun Painblade. 
disassembler uh, rip shank. I, I really I, don't I think feel they're like picking these. You're taking the mask? Yes. And the story of heavens. I'll even take Moby Dick just because. That's a traditional microscope. But yep. I. Damn pirate. No Can way to open it without. Oh, hush, guard. You're literally working for a pirate. Damn it, Petrov. I was just getting warmed up. Damn it, Petrov. I was just getting warmed up. Hi, money. Like, it feels like there should be another way of doing it. Oh, yeah, you can. Without killing anyone, I mean. Hmm. So my theory was that I would be able to, uh, like, once Petrov gave me the okay, I run in ahead, mm -hmm. turn around and run back. There's probably some kind of alarm on, on the uh, artifact itself. Probably. You're not going in there? I don't feel like dealing with lockpicking right now. Mm. And everything's expert locked. Money. So part of it, for a frame of reference, I'm utterly exhausted because I explained. Ooh, bag balls. Um, I explained this in the video that got messed up. Um, I was up until past 5:30 in the morning. Some nice weapons, actually. Really big case for some shotgun ammo. My succulent. Ox weapons key? So there was a key for that door here? I guess. That's the only key I could imagine that would have been. Also, my kingdom for a map of this place. I know. Damn pirate. Get what you came for and leave. So yeah, what? All of the guards are We're agitated. just going to let you loot the ship? Yep. That's what you get. You do what it takes to survive. I'm gonna eat your crackers. And steal all of your loot. You're lucky the captain's a coward. If it were me, more weapons. I'd say we go there. a few more rounds. Uh given that I one shotted the captain, are you sure you wanna do that? I mean don't get me wrong, you'd probably be a better foe than the captain, but one shot. Just saying. And this is back to where the captain is, right? Yep. Yeah. Filthy pirate. We're not gonna forget this. Takes one to know one. Also, we are running out of time. Oh, yeah. The uh, timer is about to go off. So, mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, 
leveled up. What exactly is this room for? How should I know? Oh! Uh... Go... Forward? Oh! Oh. That's how you would get out. That's the reason for the... Yeah. Well, yeah, that at least the, the ship has a few passages like out. that. Got it. Do you want to quit here, or do you want to keep playing until the cliffhanger? Uh, I think we'll quit here. Because I am tired. Okay. Okay, uh, I hope you've enjoyed this, and we'll talk to you next time. Bye. Bye, Internet. So what? We're just going to let you loot the ship? Yes, you are.